Hello everyone and welcome. I'm back after about one year of um, not doing a single video. So in this video I will actually go out in the forest and we will try the taking some macro photos with the uh, iPhone 12 Pro Max um, because I love to take macro photos and um, I want to see if it's possible to do in an easy way just using your phone. Uh, I'm a beginner of this uh, content so maybe a lot of you guys just like me feel uh, you don't have the time to spend uh, five hours uh, taking the photos that you want but so I decided to make this uh, photo shoot let's call it like that um, make it a challenge I will go around here for about 30 minutes and see what uh, I can find out and uh, I also decided that I will only use the phone to editing the pictures uh, when taking them. So yeah, let's start it. So one of my favorite locations here is uh, a place near an old lighthouse that is located on the top of, of this mountain here. I was here last summer but that didn't end up so good. I already now see that there is uh, quite a lot of ants here. I wonder if we could actually be able to take a picture of an ant with a iPhone. We will see later. Okay, so some flowers. from up here. So we wasn't here for the view, we were actually here to try to take some macro photos with the iPhone 12 Pro Max and uh, I'm going to start right now and we will be about 30 minutes uh, at maximum. So when I take the photos I will uh, use the 2.5 times uh, lens which give me the best close-up. So we had a failure, <laughs> the tripod broke off, um, but I think we should be able to photograph the, the ants anyway. I will just put the camera here, because I see quite many ants here.
so the time is up uh, I can say it, I used a little more than 30 minutes because uh, it uh, arrived a lot of tourists in the area and um, I don't feel confidence to go around with the camera and filming when a lot of people around um, but now I'm on my way home I will uh, try to see what we got I uh, didn't get a lot but at least something uh, before I go home I will have a little Swedish fika very important to bring when you go out Well, we will see the result very soon, because now I'm heading home. Hello again, so I'm back home and it's time for me to start uh, editing the pictures I took. Yeah, like I said, I will only be editing the pictures inside the phone directly. Uh, and I will also, well, I will not use any Photoshop or any Lightroom or anything like that, only the phone. Yeah, so I will start directly and then we will see what we what we finally get. Okay, sorry I don't have any application to uh, record the screen for the moment, but um, yeah, I will just show what typically I will do on the pictures here. The first thing I did was to duplicate the pictures that I uh, had chosen. So one of the copies now I will edit and I will just show what uh, typically I will do. I start to crop the pictures so they will fit 69. Maybe I should have thought about this before I take the pictures. Yeah, because now I, lo I lose a little here and here but I want it to fit the screen when I make the video so you can see as much as possible of the picture. Um, so start cutting it to 69 and only use the thing, the, the option that you can choose here. This for example is some I think called lava that was on one of the trees. We will start to see exposure, no, clarity. Add a little. The best way to to um, to see is if I need to change some of this is to do a lot or a less. Mm -hmm. Maybe if I do on this way I see much more in the picture. Then I will go for a little of this one. Shadows. Contrast, no, oh, quite contrast already. Brightness. I will go for a little of this. can add a little sharpness. Vignette. Mm. 
hard to say. Yeah, we go for vignette for this one. Original. I will try not to do too much to the photos, but some that has a lot of colors inside it, if I just change a little, it will be quite visible directly anyway. So now this one is finished, take the next one. So I'm finished with the uh, editing and the um, next step will be to go to the computer and uh, actually make a video, cut everything together and uh, upload for you guys. I hope it will be good.